The VC-25B has some interesting tricks up its sleeve, and among these is something straight out of a sci-fi movie. Known as the ANALQ-204 Mater, these devices are located in different parts of the aircraft, typically around the engines or tail section. Though it looks like a rather unassuming box with a bunch of cameras, don't let that fool you. This very potent system can take out a wide range of missiles without even firing a shot. It does so by using lasers that disrupt the guidance system of infrared missiles. Essentially, it's doing the multi-million dollar version of shining a light in your eye so the missile can't find Air Force One. But if that doesn't work or the missile's not using an infrared seeker, at the rear of the aircraft, there's a chaff launcher as a last resort. Chaff is basically superheated metal that gets blasted in a large cloud around the aircraft. The hope is that because of this heat and infrared qualities, the incoming missile will be confused and it will fly through the chaff instead. However, the US doesn't spend hundreds of billions a year on defense for nothing since the new VC-25B will also come fully loaded down with jammers all over the aircraft. The purpose of these jammers is to disrupt radars on any nearby enemy aircraft so they can't even get a lock on Air Force One in the first place. But in today's climate, with the threat of nuclear war higher than it has been in decades, the plane is also equipped to survive some of the worst weapons man can throw at the president. Among these are electromagnetic pulse bombs, designed to disrupt telecommunications equipment and fry computers. The plane's design team has insulated it with a Faraday shield of metals and various alloys that make it immune to EMPs.